If you understand the basics of shadow work, then you understand that it has to do with uncovering your deepest wounds or your core wounding. And it has to do with uncovering your shadow material, which is those aspects of yourself that you have repressed. When you are in this process, when you are deep into doing this work, it's really important that you don't get caught in the trap of blaming yourself. Don't get caught in the trap of blaming yourself for what you have repressed. When we're talking about what you have repressed, we're talking about the aspects of yourself, of your psyche, of your personality, of your experiences that you have shoved down into the darkness and that have since become neglected or undernourished or underloved and therefore have turned into destructive aspects of your psyche or destructive aspects of your personality. It is really important that you do not blame yourself for repressing yourself. The reason that you did this is because you needed to feel safe. The reason that you did this is because you needed love. The reason that you did this is because you didn't have the right tools at the time. The reason you did this was to protect yourself and to survive in a world that has been sending you constant messages that it's not safe to be authentic. You've been living in a world that has been rewarding you for pushing aside your deepest needs and that has been telling you that a life devoid of fulfillment and devoid of your deepest soul connection is the life that you should strive for. All of your life you've been receiving the message that the top achievement you can accomplish is a life completely without fulfillment, completely without soul connection, where you neglect your deepest needs. This is why you repressed yourself. Have compassion. Send yourself love and empathy because you have been doing the best that you can. And now that you're aware of what has been repressed, don't waste any more time. Don't get too caught up in anger or regret. Process those feelings, acknowledge them, and then make the conscious choice to be compassionate towards yourself and make the conscious choice to move forward in a way that is actively seeking to meet those needs that have been neglected. You can do this. I believe in you. Be blessed.